Hi, it's Kirby Summers, and it is seven o'clock in the morning on Tuesday. I wanted to give you a couple of updates. I'm not sure if, hey, wait a minute, like the video. You know, I try to remind myself at the very beginning to ask you, and so many of you are kind enough to do that. So please take a second to like, and if you haven't subscribed, you know, consider doing that. At least you'll get some updates when I do you know, short share something new. Um, as you all know by now, I am always researching. And um, I wrote an article, which I uploaded to my Substack for free um, uh, several days ago. I'll put a link to my Substack below. Uh, you know, you can choose to become a member and support my work. And, or if you can't do that, you're more than welcome to join for free. I do upload occasional um, free articles with a lot of information, such as the type of information I'm sharing with you today. So as you know, uh, we've all been sort of talking about the untimely death of Matthew Perry, who was a co-star in the very, very popular TV series, Friends. In an article that I wrote um, where I cover a crime that happened in New York City, which is free on my Substack, I discuss various um, TV and film producers. And then in the comments section, I provide additional details, such as the name of David Boys, the attorney who represented you know, I thought initially the number was 60 victims, but it's like almost 70 victims of Jeffrey Epstein. And in my, from my perspective, uh, boys, um, I mean, many of you already know that he was the attorney for Bill and Hillary Clinton. He was the attorney for Harvey Weinstein. You, you know, I don't have to remind you about who and what scandals each of those uh, people represent, um, other than to, yes, remind you that in Harvey Weinstein's case, they did contract the Mossad trained Black Cube in order to keep Rose McGowan and Ronan Farrow from exposing to the world that Weinstein was a serial R person. However, in again, like I was saying in the comment section, I delve deeper with Professor Hamamoto, which many of you follow. And if you're not giving him a follow on his YouTube channel, please do. Um, and I just, pro I provide additional information such as the connection to Woody Allen uh, for the TV show Friends and the connection to Jeffrey Epstein. You know, we're, we're dealing with a world, um, Hollywood and uh, popular series that um, contain uh, programming that many people are really unaware about. You know, I have discussed uh, Matthew Perry in two previous podcasts feel free to take a listen to them if you haven't. And um, I'm also hosting on my Patreon for my patrons, um, my next Ask Me Anything. It's scheduled for this weekend, November the 11th, which is Saturday and the 12th, which is Sunday. So if you're a member of my Patreon, you know, it's up there. You can It's one question per person. You can start asking it now. I'll answer it over the weekend. And um, if you haven't joined my Patreon, where I upload patron-only podcasts uh, with information that I feel, as I have stated several times, that I cannot share here on this platform, I put it there, okay? So um, this is just an update to let you know that Yes, there is the information about the odd connection between the sitcom Friends and Jeffrey Epstein, Woody Allen, and David Boies. I'll leave a link to my Substack below. Again, you're more than welcome to join for free if you 
you know, if you, if you cannot and do not want to uh, become a full member, that's fine. And I'm also going to leave a link to my Patreon if you want to participate in the Ask Me Anything. However, that is a membership situation, and that's only $5. But you have a ton of things I put up there. I put full-length books and, you know, hard-to-find information that I use for my own dot connecting in, in connection uh, with also um, the patron-only things that I put up there uh, that, again, I don't feel comfortable placing here. However, you know, uh, it's free to join my Substack and find that article. I hope you guys are good, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.